Greyfriars Kirkyard is a cemetery located at the southern tip of the old town in Edinburgh, Scotland, adjacent to George Harriet School. People have been buried there since the late 16th century, including several famous personalities from Edinburgh. It has the title of the most haunted cemetery in the world. There are hundreds of reports of attacks on people who visit it. The paranormal activity that occurs there is known as the Mackenzie Poltergeist. Stay until the end of the video to see the eerie mausoleum of the person responsible for these dark events. Additionally, there are several other stories that take place there, such as the one about the dog Bobby and inspirations for the writer of Harry Potter. The main figure behind the cemetery's notoriety is Sir George Mackenzie, and his tomb is the site of the most documented paranormal activity of all time. Hated in life, he was a lawyer who worked for the king, acting as a 17th century judge. He was responsible for the imprisonment of around 18,000 people who opposed the monarchy, known as Covenanters. They were imprisoned on the grounds that now make up the cemetery, and many died of starvation while others were executed by beheading. Mackenzie was buried on the site in 1691, but the cause of his ghostly fury occurred in December 1998 when a beggar, seeking shelter from the cold, forced his way into the mausoleum. He ended up falling down the staircase that led to Mackenzie's coffin, breaking it as he fell inside. Shortly after, covered in dirt, he fled the scene. A night watchman witnessed the event and mistook the beggar for a ghost, unaware that the real ghost had been stirred and would reveal itself later. Today, there is a night tour where the tour guide reports that over 150 people have fainted during the tour, and more than 600 have left with unexplained bruised and scratched skin, even with inexplicable injuries, including broken bones. Another peculiarity of this cemetery is the rental of iron cages, known as mort safes, to protect the graves. These cages safeguarded the corpses for the necessary time for decomposition, thus deterring grave robbers who supplied bodies to the Edinburgh Medical School for dissection. Greyfriars Cemetery served as inspiration for part of the Harry Potter story, and not far from there is the Elephant House Cafe, where the writer often worked. A belief exists that there is another grave that might also be the reason behind the malevolent forces at Greyfriars Cemetery, the tomb of a man named Thomas Riddell, a general who died in 1806, whose name bears a resemblance to the original name of Lord Voldemort, which is Thomas Riddle. This fact frequently draws Harry Potter fans. Did the Dark Wizard exist in real life? Other characters likely inspired the writer, but the grave markers were stolen, possibly by a fan who wished to keep them as a souvenir. It seems that the access below the mausoleum is securely closed with iron bars, perhaps to prevent another beggar from further angering the ghost. And the dog Bobby that I mentioned earlier? I'll talk about him in the next video. A story of loyalty that made the little dog become the mascot of the cemetery. These and other cases are showcased here on the Mystery Machine channel. If you enjoy this type of content, please subscribe, 